to Connecticut MLS, first start by going to smartmls.com. The top right you'll find a login button. From this screen, if you click on the search criteria at the top, you can drag that link into your bar so that you no longer have to click twice to get to the login screen. Start by typing your login, your password. From here you'll be able to see when you have an account balance due, information about your profile which you can edit, and by clicking on the matrix you can go into your MLS. Just like Rhode Island and Massachusetts, the Connecticut MLS has a start screen. It is customizable and you can move things into any order you like. You have a quick search, your hot sheets, the active market, some external links, and your news alerts. You can search properties right here. Please note that single family homes and condos are under the same search. So you will need to search one, the other, or both when searching for your client. Under My Matrix is where you'll be able to build a market analysis. Realist is where you'll find the tax database information. All three MLSs have a version of Realist where you can search by city, client name, bedrooms, bathrooms, and it will sort if you were to pick Middletown, three bedrooms, single family houses, every three bedroom single family house in that town will come up. You can then also save them and export or create labels to create your own database. Usually there's a limit of 5,000 per month, but it's a great way to do a mailing with a lender of your choosing. That's how to log into MLS. We'll go further in a future video. Thank you very much.